Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel and Lock and Learning. In this video, we are going to solve ICSE Mathematics Class 7 Chapter 24 Area and Perimeter Exercise 24B Question Number 11. It is a garden is 24 meter long and 14 meter wide. There is a path 1 meter wide outside the garden along its sides. If the path is to be constructed with square marble tiles 20 cm into 20 cm, find the number of tiles required to cover the path, right? Now, basically what it means here is that suppose I have a garden, right? The garden is rectangular in shape, right? This big. It's 24 meters by 14 meters. Now, around the garden, we are going to just make uh, make a path outside of it. Okay. So, you can see there is a path 1 meter wide outside the garden. This is the boundary of the garden. And outside of it, the length, this one, is what? 1 meters, right? This width of the path is what? 1 meters. Now, that means, see here, that for uh, calculating what do we need to uh, calculate here first is it's being asked that uh, how many tiles are required to cover this path right this one now that means how many tiles so that means we have to divide the area of the path by area of one tile okay so we know area of one tile is 20 centimeter into 20 centimeters so let's calculate that first right so area of one tile equals to 20 into 20 right that will be 400 square centimeters okay now this becomes area of one tile what next is we have to find area of what area of the path right so finding the area of the path will be very simple see this is 14 here right so um, see how first of all we find area of garden right area of garden so area of the garden becomes 24 into 14 that will be 6 and 5 um, 33 336 square meters okay this is the area of the garden now what next we have to find the area of the garden with the area of the path as well right so with the path right what does that give us see here with the path it will be what uh, 24 changes to plus 2 from each side so 24 becomes 26 into and 14 becomes 14 plus 2 right here also this will be 1 meters and here also this length will be 1 meters here also this will be 1 meters right so 26 into 16 okay that is going to give you what um, see here um, 16 into 675 8 uh, 90 96 so 6 here and 9 32 and 9 416 square meters right so what do we get here area of the path right area of the path so simply subtract area of the garden with the path okay and area of the garden simple that means we will subtract this area from the entire total area okay so that becomes 416 minus 336 that will be 0 uh, 11 minus 3 becomes 8 and 0 right so 80 square meters this becomes the area now see here that number of tiles fine number of tiles number of tiles what does it become 80 square meters and 400 square centimeters right so we'll convert 80 into your square centimeters and here what we will do 400 square centimeters right that will what remain as it is fine so what does this become Eight, uh, 80 square meters becomes 8 and uh, then again 5 zeros right 8 80,000 sorry 8 uh, 80,000 right 8 lakh square centimeters upon 400 here okay you can convert this using the formula we've done it directly here because it takes a lot of time right so 8 goes how many times the 4 2 and 3 zero so 2000 right so 2000 tiles right this is the total number of tiles that can be put in the what in the floor okay and friends this is all for today if you are new to my youtube channel do not forget to subscribe and leave a like on this one till then take good care of yourselves and bye